Hello everyone, today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to do green screen and flash and fade on Wondershare Filmora. So I'm, I don't have any other editors but this editor and if you use CapCut or iMovie or anything, this video is not for you but you can also watch and enjoy or you could show this to your friends who also have this um, app but anyways, we're gonna get on with it now. So I already have my recording and I already edited some of it. As you can tell, I was here at New Hillcrest and I just went to the green screen in Moreland and I just made sure I reared it at the same time, which doesn't really look like it, but it, it trust me, it's the same time. So what I'm going to do now is I'm gonna put it up there and I'm going to get my recording of lightning. Now if you don't have lightning, you're probably going to have to record it and that's all I do. All I look up is on YouTube or lightning or like whatever specific color I want of lightning and in this video I looked up red lightning so I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit it right there and I'm gonna right click with my mouse and zoom it and as you can tell it's already on select color which is green and I'm gonna go down to the recording of lightning and I'm gonna make sure it's in size which is big enough so Oh, and that, so I'm just gonna go back so if it accidentally moves it. So if it does that, and you want this to be like, what, more up? You're gonna have to put it, move it over separately. Alright, let's- Alright, that looks good. All you're gonna do now, because it just looks a little funny, is you're gonna edit it to make it look darker, which will make it the recording cooler, and then edge thickness, just- whatever would, you would like, you could put it all the way up, uh, bottom just looks a little silly, so I'm gonna put it at 0 0.6, and for the feathers, I'm gonna put it up like that, so what I like to do with my edge feather is I like to make it look really, like, subtle, like, I don't like big edge feathers, so that's why it's like that, but let's just see the results, and I have to sneeze, oh my gosh, <coughs> okay, I sneezed, alright, let's see the results. So that's what it looks like, and I think it looks pretty sick. So I'm just gonna delete that, because you don't need the extra. Otherwise, if you have the extra, like, hanging out here, it's like when the video gets to the end and the music ends, it's just gonna go, like, and continue to the very end. And then some other people were asking about, for flash, all I do is go to sample color, and I pick out whatever color I want, like, for example, I think I'm gonna do white, which looks pretty cool. And I'm gonna line it up, so I move this thing and I line it up with it. And I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna double click, go to animation, click fade in, click OK, click on this one, click on that, go to present, preset, sorry about that, and then click fade out. This is what it's gonna look like. See, so that's how you do flash, which is technically fade, but the way I did it made it look like black. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for that. And then, <clears throat> for the fade, I'm gonna get out, get out a different recording for this one, but fade, all I did. So someone asked me how I made fern in my other video disappear. And all I did was, because I had the green screen on Fern, I was like right here in Moreland for him, is I went to the very end, and I went to animation, and I just did fade out. Like, that's all I did. Actually, no, I don't think I did that. Now that I'm thinking about it. I think all I did, <laughs> I can't really remember. I think all I did was dissolve on him. Or guess not, I guess I did the fade. So yeah, I guess I did the fade, so I'm just gonna go do fade out. And the way I did it made it look like he just faded away somehow. So here it is. Yeah, I guess I did that. I have no idea though. I'm so sorry. I just totally forgot and I don't know. So now that I have flash and stuff and it looks cool. I'm going to add some effects to make it look cooler. So all I'm going to do is 
this. I'm going to move the flash aside because I don't want that to be touched. And I'm going to go to my favorites, which is all 50 of these. And my favorite is Albio, is what I call it. And it makes your screen look darker, so, which makes it look pretty epic. And I'm just going to put that at like 80 because I don't like it too strong and I don't like it too little. And then I'm going to add some flash to because this is what I added last time. It's very subtle and it's called a, a pal, a, a bell or whatever. So let's see what it looks like. Yeah, so there we go. And if I want to make it cooler and like have a little shake effect, all, all I use is this um, sideways 2, is what it's called. And I put my thing right there, move it over, pull. That's, that's what makes it shake and I got asked how did it shake. And because I don't like it like that, I'm just going to edit back some of it. Just delete that. That's all. And then I'm going to add, like, a flash. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's, uh, the results will pop up in 3, 2, 1. <laughs>